What has the process been like for you in terms of going from trying to get healthy for last season, realizing the best thing to do is to shut it down, going through the waiver process, just, I guess, uncertainty and just sort of persisting through all that? Uh, it's been a long process, honestly, but uh, I had to see it all through. Uh, I talked to my coach and my family. Uh, the best option was to come back to school uh, just for the benefit of my health. Uh, I would say I thought I was going to come back in February, late February, but uh, I think it was best for the team just to keep competing without me and uh, I'd just be there to support. Dave, how you're coming back to a completely different team almost, uh, the Trey Galloway's there and some other guys, but so many different parts and pieces into this, which I'm sure you're excited about because they're some very good players. What have you seen? What are your thoughts on the guys that have come in that you're going to be playing with? Uh, my thoughts, I mean, I haven't seen all, all of them yet uh, in person, but uh, I would say from okay. my watch, uh, I think we have a pretty, a pretty unique, unique team. Uh, we'll be more athletic than last year. Last year's team, uh, it's hard to hard to compete with Trace's athletic ability, but uh, I think Kalel, Kalel can, is, is up there because he's seven foot and, and he can actually jump out the gym too as well, and he can spread the floor out and shoot as well. Uh, and Baco, he can shoot, uh, he can score at all three levels. Uh, I mean, I can't name, I can go down the list, but I, I ain't gonna name all of them. But I think we have some pretty solid pieces coming in. Were you? How, how close did you come to playing last year? I mean, how, how tight was that decision? And then also, how was the waiting through the waiver process, which I imagine was pretty really stressful? Um, I mean, I didn't know I probably was gonna come back probably the Iowa game. Uh, you know, I know I came out and warmed up. <laughs> I gave the fans a little something, but uh, just that I was doing, doing better. Uh, but I mean, it was it was a long process getting my waiver as well. Uh, um, once I got it, my, my waist was on my shoulder. Coach had called me, told me, he asked me if I wanted to transfer. I was like, if I want to transfer, what you mean? I want to transfer. Uh, was, did I not get my waiver? And he was like, yeah, you got your waiver. You want to come back and play for me? I was like, yeah. So, I mean, it was just it was just stressful even once, once I got my, my waiver. Done. Was there was there any indication at all that you got during that process, or did you just have to wait like everybody else? Uh, I really just had to wait, uh, honestly. Uh, I mean, there's nothing to the the process but waiting. On social media, it seemed like you were trying to encourage guys to come to Indiana. Did you, did you try and participate in, in help building the team and, and getting guys around you that you wanted to play with? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I was probably one of the, one of the first people that coach coach actually asked uh, about players. Um, I was. He asked you what guys you were interested in. Yeah, or? yeah. But not really what he. But I mean, I, I would say I would be a coach at that point. But yeah, I mean, he asked me if, who I was interested in, and I told him, and, and we got a couple of guys that I that I actually like. Uh, I think that we we, could, we built a solid solid team coming in for next week because uh, of guys you saw how they could play and, and you thought they would fit well with you. Yeah, or? yeah, uh, yeah. Like Khalil, Khalil can run the floor, athletic, can set screens, get off the, get off the ball. Uh, and Bago can shoot. Uh, you know, Trey, Trey's develop his three point shot as well. I mean, he will be another another combo guard to me. Uh, you know, we got the, all the freshmen coming in as well. Uh, I mean, I just think we have a really good team. Where are you right now from a health perspective? Well, I'm 100. What what do you want to work on against the summer in terms of like what's what's the next step in Xavier Johnson's game? Uh, just being consistent. Uh, I would think I have to set my score my scoring ability up this year. Uh, uh, I would say say I would have to, to score the ball for my team uh, when needed because uh, I think I'll have to be one of the top scorers on my team. Uh, even though I had to play pass a lot too, uh, I had to get my teammates involved. That's my that's my best attribute. So I would say I would say just scoring on a consistent basis. Corral brings a pick and pop aspect to the offense. Have you played with somebody like that? What do you think it'll do for your game? Uh, I mean, I haven't played anybody. I would say that's more consistent than him. I, uh, and I haven't really played played with a big. I've played with a big his size, but not a big that can jump and, and stretch the floor as well. So I mean, it'll be different. It'll be different. I, well, I actually played with Hunter. I was different, and I don't think nobody want to see me a hundred together. So, <laughs> what's been your impression of the? Uh, sorry, what's been your impression of the of the freshman guards, Gabe and Jakai? I guess how much of a leadership or mentorship role are you? you think you'll have with those uh, guys? I mean, being a six year old guy, <laughs> it's crazy <laughs> to say. Um, I would say I would have to, I would have to be big bro. Uh, you know, I'm not not there to be their dad or anything. You know, because I'm I could probably be their dad. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I would say I, I would, I, I'm, I'm accepting, accepting it, uh, being a big bro, and just getting them through the freshman year of college because I know how hard it is just being a freshman coming in. Uh, you know, I can't wait to see them both next week. Uh, yeah, I think you guys are already here, I think. Uh, but I just can't wait to, wait to see both. Okay. I'm going to bring Jalen in Thanks. next. Thank you very much. Thank